Hey guys, I'm back with a new video and I'm gonna show you how to apply your makeup to oily skin or basically what you need to do before and after you apply it. The first thing that you need to do that is necessary is cleanse your skin. I would recommend using a gentle cleanser, nothing with any harsh ingredients because that is actually gonna increase the sebum production and then you're just gonna have super, super oily skin at the end of the day, whether you wear makeup or not. Now this step is optional, you can tone your skin. Again, it needs to be a toner that is not so harsh so that you don't irritate or dry out your skin, which is gonna produce more oil. The next step that is crucial as well, I feel like all of these steps are, is to moisturize. You wanna make sure that you hydrate your skin so that your skin isn't dry or feels the need to produce more oil than it naturally does. Also, if you have acne scars like me, I would recommend using an SPF. And when I'm applying my moisturizer, I like to pat it in my skin instead of rubbing it. Now this next step is optional and I just like to apply this oil-free mattifying gel. And you can wear this with or without makeup. I just like the fact that it helps mattify my skin, but it's not too harsh on the skin where it's gonna make my skin irritated or produce more oil than it needs to. Alright, so on to the makeup. The next step is priming the skin. You want to try and find a primer that helps kill shine, like the Shine Killer from NYX, which is a more affordable version, or the Makeup Forever Base Mattifying uh, Primer, which helps basically mattify your face completely, and both of them have mattifying properties, which helps reduce the appearance of oily skin and oil production. Now we're moving on to the foundation. You need to find a foundation that is oil-free, and it's also great to find a foundation that is mattifying. Both of these foundations are mattifying. I have a drugstore version for you and a high-end version for you. I'm actually gonna use the drugstore version because I love it. And this foundation is matte, which is perfect for people like us who have oily skin because you just primed your face with a mattifying primer. Now you have matte foundation, so everything is just gonna look nice and clean and oil-free. So the next part is setting your makeup. You wanna set it with a translucent powder. You don't really wanna set it with foundation because it's gonna look super cakey and that is what actually leads to even more oil production because your skin can't breathe. So you wanna use a very light, fine translucent powder. I'm gonna use the Makeup Forever one. This is also gonna help lock in your makeup and keep it set in place all day. So now I'm gonna speed it up and just finish the rest of my makeup because you don't need to see that. The next thing is setting spray. You want to use a setting spray because this is really gonna lock in your makeup even more. I like to use one that is for like all day or all night that just locks it in and tightens it up. Like seriously, after you spray it, it like feels like you have Botox. Then I just go back over and powder it again just to remove any shine. Now the last step is just to make sure you carry blotting papers or a pressed translucent powder around with you. I know it's super annoying that us oily skinheads have to carry makeup so that we can touch up throughout the day, but at the end of the day, we can't completely stop the oil production. We only can reduce it. But doing some of these steps will definitely help your makeup last longer throughout the day. I really hope that my tips were helpful. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe, comment, and thumbs up if you liked it, and... I'll see you in my next video. Deuces.